Hello everybody, welcome to the week 5 game in the Super League between Sol and Andy Davo. Um, Andy Davo has won every single game so far, 4 out of 4. Very impressive. Up against Sol, who's done alright. Um, we can see here he's on 3 points, 1 win, 1 draw, 2 losses. And uh, if he wins here he'll go up to 5, so he'll, you know, he could finish 3rd if he wins. And of course Sol loves the practice and everything, so he'll be definitely definitely be giving his all in this match and in the booth with me is the guy who's just who's just finished the era there has been an end of an era just now this moment dimmy g hello okay a little gm here but for some reason i don't have sound in a uh, discord ah well that's a bit of a problem <laughs> hello find <Fimey>. me <laughs> hello oh it's gone He's gone. Oh, yeah. He's gone. Okay. Hey, maybe now? Yeah, I can hear you. We can hear you, fine. Damn it, still nothing. Okay, he can't oh, hear he us. He can't hear us. He can't hear us. <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, rats are tier two. Because I can uh, the stream, yes, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> rats are tier two and uh, Necro are tier three. Believe it or not. Believe it or not, Necro are tier three in this room. So, yeah. Which is why Andy's gone four and zero, and uh, Diamed's gone four one zero, and uh, I did rubbish. <laughs> hey! Uh, no, so there's a there's a skill slot, right? So, so the way the, so the the way it works is um, you can swap like there's the different packages, right? And uh, and. Andy's taken the package where he gives up a skill for extra cash, and Sol has got one less skill because he's stacked. So they've both so they've both expanded in uh, the gap has expanded in size. Yep, no problem. <laughs> now I fixed it. Ah, hello, Fimey. Hello. <laughs> Share the screen. I want to see to watch this. If this is the, the end of an era. I've I've already I've already shared it. I shared it as you were uh, as you were struggling. Oh. <laughs> oh, there you go. Yeah, it's true, true, true. <laughs> A solid defense. So I uh, Sol won the toss and chose to kick, which I would never do, but Sol did. Interesting. Oh, he does have the chance of one turn. No, it's not so bad. I was thinking, like, so kicking gives him a higher chance of the one turn, which which it does, right? Because there's more chance of him keeping his uh, keeping his rat ogre, so that he needs the rat ogre for the one turn. Doesn't his he? famous rat ogre. Yeah, yeah. We kept the same rat ogre as his team name because uh, his rat ogre was getting killed instantly <laughs> every game. Every game. Every single game. This is interesting. Why has he gone with the two stand firmers on the left? It's interesting, isn't it? Yeah, I don't know. Why has he, why has he done that? I don't know. Guess we'll find out. Yeah. Whose speech is this? Is this Sol's speech? I think Choice. it's Sol's, yeah. I knew that man was a savage. Powerless. <laughs> Monster, but yeah, this proves it. It's absolutely uh, despicable, isn't it? It might be Andy's. I don't know. It's Souls are the home the home team here, but then I guess no, you're always the home team. This is Souls. Yeah, yeah this is Souls yeah. pitch. Yeah, you always the he home had team it against Chanter, mm. and he had it against someone else as well. Against you. Yeah. <laughs> when will Cyanide decide on the cheating incident? In Good ball three before or after the data. Very good, Christopher. The yep, the. Uh, He'll probably decide after the World Cup that he's banned from the World Cup. <laughs> after he's won it. Oh, I've heard a lot of that. I heard a lot of that. What, what's that about? Um, oh, yeah, nice. well, well, we'll just briefly cover it because obviously you don't want to make it the main focus of the stream. But um, there was an incident where some coaches um, span into each other. Well, you know, we don't know that they, they like, you know, try to spin into each other. But upon spinning into each other, they uh, they like farm passes and stuff and touchdowns on their like positionals, whatever, and and like you know had five five draws, etc. So um, you know, great start. 
you know, so that so there you go. So obviously some people aren't very happy about it because they've been spinning into them and uh, you know they've had farmed up teams. So yeah. I am absolutely astonished hearing that. Never in my life have I heard about any cheating scandal in Blood Bowl. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, great start for Devo, wasn't it? Instant, instant cars. He's also going to get to punch an extra two rats. Yeah. Well, yeah, an extra two rats. I don't know where he's blitzing. Maybe he's not blitzing. Maybe the Wraith's blitzing and then repositioning. Uh, there you go. Yeah. So, is he not going to take the second block then? He's not going to put his goal in there, is he? Another uh, cast KO mm -hmm. this time. Mm, yeah, nine right. In. So an extra hit, right? Ah, uh, okay. So now he's got both these hits, yeah. right? Yeah. Pretty nice. Yep, yeah, really nice. And then that goal's got to drop down to below the golem. Oh, he's just going to make the cage. Yeah, I mean, the cage is so good. problem is though, like, is if you fail the pickup, right? If you put the goal two below the golem and you fail the pickup, it's not as bad. But True. Not so. True, but you know, he's got a big old cage, hasn't he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got the guards in both places as well. Pretty yeah. nice. Yeah, this is really nice. Really nice. So he's got to punch an extra two rats, and yeah. he's got the ball in a cage. Surrounded yeah. by guard. Yeah. So nice, nice, perfect defense. Yeah, nice kick in the solid against, defense. Was against perfect defense, being a course. Mm. Does get to hit the right does get to hit a wraith potentially if he rolls a two plus two plus. Yep. Which is two plus two plus two plus. It's obviously the problem with this is that the rag is instantly going to hit a wraith. Yes, and all of his all of his uh, gutters are exposed instantly. It's just man, Skaven might be rubbish. Yeah, <laughs> fighting. I they're they're my worst team on tabletop. To be fair, I've I've got a feeling <laughs> Skaven might be rubbish. Yet the top player in Naf style is Skaven. Just one turners, on it. If they don't die, it's just one turners, and then weird, isn't it? I mean, if you dack it, like you'd still have 11 players. True. But then it solves would have taken him 10 minutes and uh, <laughs> it might have still ended up really badly, so it's tough, isn't it? It's tough to know what to do. Yeah, the problem is Rauga might bite his tackle blitzer, unless he yeah. wants to do but he has, to, he has to stand him up first, otherwise it's two into one. Right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, goes for the cheeky one, one D, works. Yeah, I'm not sure about that. Oh, I guess this way he gets to hit both of them, right? That's... Yeah. And then he gets to save his blitzer from the roger activation. <laughs> What's he going to do? Just move him and then try it without, yeah. yeah. There you go, now he's safe. <laughs> he's going to get his roger oh. served. Yeah, this is it. If he doesn't activate, he's getting served. Yeah. <clears throat> so he's going to still step him towards the sideline. Uh, yeah, yeah, 100%. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. There we no go. Pal. Ah, there surfed, you go. Surfed Roger. Yeah, goodbye, Mr. Roger. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> he's got to, like, screen it with gutter runners. That's how stupid this is now. He literally has to screen, use his gutter runners to screen his, his Roger. Otherwise, it's, like, a million percent getting served. Oh my god, he's doing it with the stripper. Oh. <laughs> Don't do it with that one. <laughs> oh. Don't do it with that one. Whoa. Oh my god. It's Why so are you doing dumb. it with that one? It's so dumb that he had to screen his rogue with gutters. <laughs> just do all oh, gutters oh, exposed. Why, why, didn't, why, didn't he, why, why didn't he just use a skillless one though? I don't know. Maybe this one was closer than the only movement nine. <laughs> He needed to look, look, look. The one that he's just moved could be the stripper, like. Yeah. I mean, the one that he's just moved is also surfable as well. So. Yeah. Correct. The the well, the stripper's surfable, isn't it? The stripper's surfable, but obviously. It... Yeah, you'd have to like. I mean, I just smashed. I just 3D the stripper to be honest with you. Yeah. 
And if you if you fail to power it, then you get to surf it as well, potentially. <laughs> now, this is pretty good because it's hard to stop those assists. On that guy now. So this, this is pretty good. Pretty well, good recovery. That this is not how we're supposed to go, or let's keep it. <laughs> no. Yeah, no. you say it's a pretty good recovery. Like it, It's a pretty good protect my rat rigger strategy, but it doesn't <laughs> do anything for his drive. Does it? Oh, no, 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 no. The drive is fucked, but the uh, the stun here really helps, right? Because it, it makes this like three-wide screen and protects these two, which, as you say, one of them could have been the... Like, this one could have been a stripper, but... Um, this is pretty good. This is pretty good. But yeah, he's obviously he's three dice. If this guy. guy gets Kaz, it's I'm calling GG. Oh, Will he him? push it? Yeah, well, he's, got, he's got to push it. Yeah. He can still surf him. See? Oh, he, did he take the power? No, he's going for the surf. <gasps> he's gonna, oh, is he gonna? He's gonna fill it in with a goal. Is he? He's gonna fill the square with a goal. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't hate what? this honestly because that player's so freaking yeah. like horrendous. I think I. Did he need the assist first? Whoa. Yeah, he did. Yeah, yeah. Because there's two, there's two assists on. The oh, board. now he doesn't dodge. Wow. Let off. Yeah. Let off. Got a reroll burn there. Did Unless he dies? It's so. Oh. Oh. Just a stun. And he's got a 1D on the Rogar. Does he take the 2D? Where's the ball going? Ball's got to come all the way down by that zombie, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just going there. Pre-made cage. Oh, that's next to a roger, so this is a bit of a problem. Yeah, yeah, and the problem is if the wraith can only block the roger backwards or sideways. It's so. come, got to come here, right? The ball's got to come into this cage. Just make the cage here. He has more than enough players to cover the yeah, rest of the cage anyway. So. Or even all the way back. I was thinking there, yeah. That's mental, because now you... No, can... not there, one square back. I was thinking one square back, and then put this guy in, and then punch the rogue. Yeah, punch the rogue, yeah. Yeah, I would, I'd hate going one square away, because what if you don't power him? I mean, what if you even do power him? Uh, he's got loads of guards. Will the rogue die? Yeah, he's got loads of guards. It's actually all fine. It's all fine. You can't get a stripper off that easily. Well done, school. <laughs> so, yeah, it didn't really matter where he put the ball in the end, because there's just too many... Too much guard everywhere. I can't believe he put the stripper there. I know. Got a reroll burn though. He did, yeah. And, and, like, funnily enough, Davo's now in a worse position now than <laughs> yeah. what he was last turn. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like, I don't know. It's really weird. It's mm. really, really weird. So at least Saul, Saul could like do a reset now because he's got linemen that he can stand up and then use them to screen the gutters. I think Andy's just concentrating on banging for the first three turns anyway. Oh, of course he is, yeah. But, but well, that's what I mean, like Saul can protect his gutters. Like he can either go for a crazy ball shot, which isn't going to happen, or he can, he can at least protect his gutters now. <clears throat> bronze rank on TFT. I was I was never uh, I was never bronze. You must I, have been bronze when you first started. No, I bypassed it. Um, yeah, I'm like silver one now. I think I haven't played it since I got. I got to the one below challenger. I didn't bother going to challenger. Is that what? That's like diamond or no? It's, like yeah, it's diamond. I think diamond or platinum. Yeah, whichever one it was. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. It just, I, I know I wasn't challenger. That's all I know. Right. You was at iron. Oh right, I forgot iron existed. <laughs> Yeah, I just, I just, didn't, I don't really like TFT, honestly. Like, don't like it enough to play it. Hello, 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 Chanda. Did you say you and Chanda are playing tonight? Are you playing on the weekend? Yeah, we're playing at seven tonight. Yeah. What tonight? I've got to make spaghetti bolognese. Yeah, I've got to have my dinner. I thought I was going to have a chance in between. <laughs> in between, I might have to have my dinner while this match is going on. Elliot, oh style. my god. Don't worry, yeah. guys. I'm here to cover you. Glorious. <laughs> Glorious. Go for your dinner, lazy <laughs> bastard. <laughs> oh, um, I saw Uranus this weekend. <laughs> you weren't supposed to tell anyone, Dimmy. <laughs> uh, right. yeah. Well, that, uh, that's clearly the end of an era. <laughs> <laughs> I'll send, I'll send you that picture in confidence. 
<laughs> no, I mean at the Robert Kirk Centre. Oh, yeah. The planets, wasn't it? The planets. Yeah. <laughs> Flip me. <laughs> it's amazing how funny Uranus is, isn't it? Yeah, Elliot saw <laughs> Jupiter. Yeah. And he moaned about how small it was. <laughs> they were life size, though, aren't they? They're life size. Well, like, yeah, the scale or something, aren't they? Yeah, they're all the scale. Yeah, yeah, not life size, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. The planet of the. the yeah. Uh, the Blue Ball thing, yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's he's true, what, it's wicked, that. yeah. Oh, God. Oh, he's he dodging. Doing? Is that a misclick or is that a legitimate 5 plus dodge? I've got no. No, legitimate. He was only uphilling, wasn't he? So. Yeah, up hill's no. not, not that bad with um, Juggernaut. It's pretty fucked up, isn't it? It's pretty bad, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty no, right. What the hell are you talking about? Uh... Like, it's not yeah. that unlikely to fail, but it's, yeah, but the problem is, is Blitz in the sidestepper, so he's going to end up even closer to the sideline, so dodging's probably just better. Yeah, yeah, there's no one he could blitz, like, it was all bad. He's either blitzing the fleshy into it, getting hit by a claw or he's wolf. hitting the wolf into into getting surrounded and surfed or he's hitting the side steppers into getting surrounded and surfed so yeah it was all it was all the hits were terrible and the other thing is, is like he doesn't want to still be on his feet so and he can surf the gutter runner by surfing the rogue alliance yeah here he gets a three into three into a three from the fleshy so a very nice <coughs> hit. i bet andy's really happy right now yeah oh really i wouldn't have done that Full power. That's right? weird, isn't it? Is this a GFI? No, the last square movement. That doesn't even break armor. <laughs> what the? <laughs> oh man. But that is great. And he even has close. Uh, you might fail this, to be fair. I think I would. It's a very juicy fall. foul. Yeah, I think gutter runners. Gutter runners and war dancers. And troll slayers. <laughs> <laughs> a special place in my heart for fouling. Why troll slayers? I just hate them, Jim. I just hate <laughs> troll slayers. I don't know why. It's completely irrational. <laughs> it's, it's. I think it's like because like you know when they frenzy trap themselves into a failed dauntless into like double red dice powers and kill your like big guy. Mm. It's that, it's that sort of thing. I think I've just had reoccurring issues with. Uh... Yeah, he's fouling. Yeah. Fair. The problem is he had to foul before he moved the wraith, so he gets sent off the gutter on his back again. I don't think he moves the wraith. You don't think he stepped... Oh, wait, well, you keep the uh, Brogad tagged. I think... I'd be tempted to keep the stripper pinned on the side, but then it's only 3-2 out anyway, isn't it? Yeah. It's not... I guess he's letting him back up so he can kill him. Like You know, like yeah. in UFC, so like, I'm not getting on the floor and wrestling. You get up, I'm going to knock your head off. <laughs> Come on up, you get so I can punch you again. Yep. Nine, nine players for Sol, eleven for Andy. This is a, a massacre at the moment, isn't it? Well, mate, it's been nine players since turn one, so <laughs> like it's it's not like it's the last two turns. Have it's only of... turn three, though. To me. <laughs> yeah, but he's got yeah, two bench. I mean, it's two it's whole got... turns. You know, Sol should be used to be playing with nine. <laughs> Even if the KO comes doesn't come back, he's gonna have eleven for his one turner at the moment. At the moment, yeah. And honestly, like, how relieved would he be that he's got a with, uh, strip and wrestled in gets served, right? Huge that was incredibly relief, lucky. Yeah. That was incredibly lucky. Oh, here we go. Two into two. Yeah, two into two, yeah. Uh, it's a juggernaut. Oh, oh just don't, God. and just take the boat down with mighty. Oh, you wouldn't have mighty, though, would he? Uh, old school rules, Jimbo. Old school rules. Diced. And he just gets an instant 2D back on him. Yeah. This rogue has been horrendous. Yeah. <coughs> oh, where's oh. he going? In for the assist. On the the pal. Oh, side steppy steppy. No, oh, AV break. Just a stun. Good stun though. Mm. And he's got like a little. Mate, would you be pushing forward next turn here, Jim? I'd always push forward, yes. 
Push forward. Push forward. Push no, forward. no, you, you've just got to think about the strip, haven't you? And, and how how best you can mitigate the strip and how much you Push can bang. The guard, isn't it? You've got to keep the guarders in the corners. You've got to bang and you've got to protect against the strip. There, you, there, you two big things. Just think about strippers while you're banging. That's what you've got to do. Oh, I couldn't do that, Jim. Otherwise, it, I wouldn't be banging very long. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We have, we have heard all that. <laughs> I try and think about uh, other stuff. <laughs> Maggie Thatcher. Yeah. Naked on a cold day, yeah. <laughs> That was fucking. Do you remember? Do you remember uh, San Andreas? San Andreas, and it was uh, it was him from Happy Mondays, wasn't it? I can't remember his name. Oh, Bez. No, not Bez. The actual one from Happy Mondays. Oh, the singer. I got no yeah. idea. Yeah. yeah, he was. He did the voice, and he was. <laughs> he was like fucking. I think he was. Uh, I don't know who Sean was. Ryder. Oh yeah. Yeah, Sean Ryder. yeah. Sean Ryder. Yeah, and he was like. They were like he was in the recording studio going, Oh, Maggie! <laughs> <laughs> Maggie! <laughs> in, the, in the fucking uh, thing. It was. Ooh, Danny Dyer was in that as well, wasn't he? In San Andreas. Was mm. he? Yeah, yeah. He was Kent Paul. You're talking, was, you're talking about the computer game. Yeah, oh, he was Kent in Miami Paul. Vice as well. He was in Miami Vice as well, yeah. You schlag. Yeah, yeah Miami Vice and. and uh, Mate, and his armor rolls have been horrendous. Or like, they've just dried up since. Yeah, so. not horrendous, but yeah. I mean, he's uh, he has made two removals in in, but yeah. Yeah, it's like the last three turns he's done nothing. He's got yeah. a stun on a rat, and he's banged a lot as well. To be fair. Yeah. Not Very horrendous, good. but yeah, not not good. I mean, it's enough to make me go. Ah! <laughs> oh, I mean, I'd probably say they were horrendous if they were my dice. <laughs> yeah, yeah, if they were mine, I'd, I'd be binning them and picking up my next set. Yeah. This is uh This is well out of left field. What yeah. the hell? I what don't the hell? That. Blitz him with block, isn't it? Yeah, but you know he's got a wolf. He's probably, he's probably worried. Well. Artemis is watching. That's what it is. <laughs> like, oh god. He was like, oh, I didn't mean the ball carrier, you idiot. <laughs> <laughs> and this is actually like leaving this. This is actually inviting the strip now, unless he uh, plugs in the rate in the front, which obviously he will. He will, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, no. What? Maybe he's going to put the zombie in there. Oh, no, man. Okay, well, this is it then. Here we go. Five plus for an uphill. Was he sent off as well? Yeah. Fails oh, the argument oh, call well, on a one. one. I mean, he can't the yeah. So, who's, who's gonna play instead of Andy? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so. it's minus one on, on brilliant coaching results and uh, can't argue the call anymore. What? Right, Jimmy. <laughs> Absolutely game changer. Oh, I, I always forget the minus one on the uh, coaching events. Mm. Well, I say I forget. I just didn't know there was a minus one on coaching. <laughs> yeah, there is. Yeah, because like you count yourself, right? You're you're the head coach, so you count yourself. Oh, really? And if you're sent off, yeah, yeah. But obviously, both one of both sides have got one, so you just so you don't actually add one plus the number of just... assistant coaches. You add the assistant coaches, but wait, if you're sent off, you get a minus one. Yeah. So if you roll a five, it's a four, or if you roll a five, it's a five, but you don't plus one. If you roll a five, it's a four. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Remember the good old days uh, of Andes, uh, Jimmy, when the Andes team lost the coach for whatever reason, they lost Regen? Yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah, because it was your yeah. necromancer that did the raising, the, like, you know, did the healing. The and regeneration and all oh, that. That's amazing. That should, bring that, that should bring it back. To be fair, Regen was a two plus once. <laughs> yes, it was a two plus. So it was like a. Uh, but you will never see an under team becoming such a bunch of cowards. Here we go. Here we when go. Was it? The, ne the, negro, <laughs> the negro. Five. Five plus Hang ten on. uphill. Is it? Oh, and it's only uphill red dice as well. Yeah, isn't uphill it? red. Yeah, I'm not three. Like I'm not three. Only two. Yeah. Yeah. And he's got the bloodshot. You might be thinking about. I mean, he might not be going for it, but if he's going for it, you've got to think whether you come in th this side and push out here. Nah, I think you come straight now. Going straight in the front. Yeah, I don't think he's going for it. I don't think he's going for it. He is. He's, he's, he's put out. the gazer in. He's put the gazer in. Yeah. Oh, yeah, there you go. Fails the dodge in. Oh my God! What a dice! 
What's the what's what's the five Wait. on the dice? It's like didn't, didn't he reroll the dodge? I oh, know, failed the dodge. Let's kill. Yeah, yeah, he's got. It, it automatically dodges for you, so he yeah, failed yeah, the dodge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So forty percent is it that five plus? Uh, for the dodge in, it's fifty-five percent. Oh bloody hell! Yeah. Terrifying, isn't it? Yeah, it's ridiculous. Like it's 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 amazing how likely things are. Like six plus troll dodges. Yep. Or a uh, chaos oh, warrior well, well, or carrier yeah, dodges. Yeah. Five plus <laughs> five, five three two two. Yeah. That was my fault, wasn't it? It should have been three four four three. Yeah. So and then not have the distance, so it was, it was ultimately bad play. Oh no, knockdown! This is a right mess for turn five. It is, isn't it? Yeah, they say it started yeah. so amazingly. It's um, I mean the good. Needs for Andy is the stripper is going to be very far away from the action. But, uh, Not that far away, because if he gets him far away, then he opens himself up to the the gutter swarm. So it's not going to be he's not going to be a you, million miles you, away from the action. Would you one assist foul that gut runner? Nah, I don't think I don't think he could afford to. So, okay, so you clear the golem with the zombie yeah. and then run the golem up behind. Yeah, yeah. yeah. all right, all right. He's doing armor break here. Yeah. Oh, nice armor break. Just an eight into a five. Wow. Yeah, I was saying that, Chunter. It's funny, right? Naf rats seem absolutely terrible every time. Every time we see them, but then the number one ranked player in the Naf it, is ranking us with Skaven. So crazy, isn't it? Well, tell the name of the guy who's the number one coach of the Naf. Olivier Dulac. Oh, there you go. Right. It's the guy in the BBSL, yeah. Yeah, he's super league. He, he, he finished bottom of his group. <laughs> and made me think Skaven aren't very good. And, you know, Sol's finishing maybe second bottom in this. Or, or like, you know, because it's not looking like he's beating Andy right now. Well, the thing is, as well, like, what you got to bear in mind is, like, in NAF, teams will be playing for wins more, right? I think. Yes. So, they're going to expose themselves to, like, Skaven more than it would be if you were just happy to take the draw. Yes. Like, so if Skaven's scoring six, you're going to really stretch for that goal, where even if it's very unlikely, you could just... Yes, that is a good time. They're, ve they're very suited for to going for wins, but they're pretty bad at getting them, I think. But, yeah, but there you go, it's uh, hard to argue. Well, it's hard to argue with the absolute fact that Olivier Dulac is the number one ranked. Athlete, isn't it? so you that, yeah. That's a fact. He's, he's written in his stone. Mm. And he must have been beating some good players, otherwise his ranking never would have got that high. Mm. Apparently, yeah, like, would it just take French. a long time, wouldn't it? Well, yeah, he's got over 100 games. He's got like 140 something games, I checked there. Mm. But, um, like, apparently, the French standard, like, the, the, the average French blood bowls, bowler is better than the English average blood bowler. Wow. Yeah. I, I think. I wouldn't doubt that. Yeah. Have you seen English blood bowlers, Dimmy? I've seen one or two. Yeah. Terrible. I've seen one or two. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Some of them are. Yeah. <laughs> Some of them can't even beat Chaos with uh, Dark Elves. Some of them don't even field their whole team. They just leave them in a box. So. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Some of them get dice pinged off their head halfway through the game. <laughs> and then and then go back to a feast of sausage rolls. Oh my god. Full <laughs> <laughs> A lot of English blood ball players play for Wales, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Hancock's officially Welsh. Is he? Well apparently on his nap page, yeah. Mm. He never told me he was doing that either. He just he just quietly became Welsh overnight. He is living there, though, isn't he? Yeah, he lives in Wales. Yeah. So he's he's a lot more Welsh than most of them. <coughs> he's got more claim to be Welsh than. Who lives in Wales? Uh, Hancock. Ah, all right. Yeah, that beats that beats half of the team. <laughs> I don't think any of the team live in Wales, to be honest with you. <laughs> like, I don't know. I don't know who is on Team Wales this year. I don't really look. He'll just stand firm here, I think, because he's not 
nothing good's happening to him. No, he's blitzing, it's Juggernaut. Oh, it's Juggernaut, yeah, he won't, he won't just stand firm here then. Wait, did Sol fuck up? Uh, Sol pushed him into the sidestep bar, so now he's got an extra guard on him, so it's yeah. into <laughs> Sol, <laughs> just, <laughs> Sol just fucked it, yeah, well done, Sol. He should have just pushed it into the tackle guy, I don't know where yeah. it Flip me. Mm. I mean, the only thing that this is proving is that knobs are better than rats. Yeah. That's why I shouldn't have chosen them. Tanders choose knobs? Yeah. He's lost every game so far, but he's gonna win. He's gonna win in about an hour and twenty minutes. He's just definitely guaranteed gonna win. Oh, because you are not showing up. <laughs> no, I'm gonna show up, but I, I, I've slated knobs too much. Like I'm guaranteed to lose, aren't I? It's like, it's absolute. It's absolute. The karma is inevitable. <laughs> What time's that game on? Um, an hour and twenty minutes. Seven UK time. At seven PM UK time. Yep. Or if you are watching this on YouTube, probably the next video. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you won't see the uh, previous video, uh, if ever. No, no, never, no, that one, that one's never, never ever coming to line. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to post on your little clip that the era has ended. <laughs> <laughs> no one will believe you because there's no evidence. <laughs> I'm gonna have to upload my own video, no, I'm just gonna, uh, hello, my name's Timmy G. <laughs> Look, this is the this is the end of an era, <laughs> and I'll just accuse you of uh, live editing live video footage. <laughs> that was, that was dope. Do you remember that fucking Blood Bowl, Blood Bowl Two? Oh my god, what a joke! I never knew that. You're lucky. Exactly, exactly, Pablo. Oh my god, yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yes. Yeah, I need to update it for the, the, the current memes, don't I? I need a, Do you know you know you know the song Sex and Drugs and Rock and Roll? We should we should get Hellboy to make um nuts <laughs> nuts and bananas and sausage rolls. <laughs> Hey, oh, you me having fun. <laughs> it's amazing he's been able to survive into his 30s, having met him, like, honestly. <laughs> yeah, all of us, I think. <laughs> Just be wandering around in his pants and his socks eating sausage rolls. <laughs> Oh yeah, nuts and socks and sausage rolls! <laughs> oh, fuck me. It's all Elliot needs. That's brilliant, isn't it? Oh my god. So, Sol hasn't really had the reset turn to get back in front of anything, has he? It just, it just hasn't happened for him. Um, he's got a bang out there. Regen works. He's still just desperately trying to get this uh, Roger involved in any way possible. I mean, he, he will be able to get him on the cage here, won't he, if he gets pushes into powers. But then obviously he'll just get cleared off pretty easily as well, you would think. Okay, does the block there? Interesting. No, no, I, the fleshy, right? If he blitz the fleshy, because it's five, six, seven, eight versus four, five, six, and then you push him into there. But then I guess it's in you know, a one D again, and then he could have, you know, and then he could have powered him, and then he would have gone in there. Oh, 
almost tinking of the jugs, but yes, obviously the sidestep stops him, stops him going in that way. But if he powers him on the initial hit, he gets to base the ball, hitting the, hitting the ray. So he probably just goes for that right and just hopes he gets the instant power. Oh, here we go. But if you get pushes into power, then you just get instantly nailed by a, by a wolf. <laughs> Which isn't what you want, unless you're a furry. Well, oh. Oh, he blitzes the wolf, gets a push. At least uh, there's a chance of the roger getting free at last. Yeah. Gets the pow. Mighty bow, nothing. And then base the ghoul, I guess. Eh? Yeah. Yeah, he just kind of needed a bit more back, didn't he? Like, it's actually 9 versus 10 players. He hasn't taken any more removals after, like, the first turn, but he still somehow just had all of his players down and never really in a good spot. It's uh, versus 9, because there is the send-off. It's 9 versus 9, oh, because yeah, there is the send-off yeah. and the injured one. Yeah, so it was 9v9. But this 4 over here is killing him, isn't it? This 4, 4 versus 2 is really killing him. If you could have got these guys out and had... Six in front and these two on two, it would have been amazing, but so it's like five versus four up here. Lack of three plus dodges from a uh, song. Yep. This is another discovery this cabins I'm used to see. <laughs> Couple three plus is dodges, you could have uh, solve a lot of things. One way or the other. Mm. It's just the fleshy, isn't it? The fleshy is the sticking point here, is of where he can get the fleshy. And he might have to like double GFI with it. Fleshy up to there. Yeah, I think the fleshy has to double GFI. Can't double you know, but then it's either the fleshy GFIs or the ghoul GFIs. So I don't think he can risk a three-point cage versus a stripper. I guess Dimi is uh, preparing his spaghetti bolognese. <laughs> nah, not yet, not yet. Well, actually, no, he can do the three-way cage because if he has a three-man cage or with guard, then he's only getting three D uphill, isn't he? So he actually could have made a three-point cage, but no. He's just doing the one GFI here. Oh, I thought this was a GFI from the ghoul, so yeah, no, it's all right. It's a, didn't need anything at all. I don't know what I was thinking there. I thought for some reason that the fleshy had to be the, the forward part, but obviously it could just be the back part. Oh, just eat oh. this. Eat, you only you have no rerolls left. You have to eat it. Oh, but that means oh, the, he stacks the... it. He stacks it. Oh, why did he do an extra GFI? I don't know. He didn't want to be oh to stop him chaining him backwards or something. I don't know. Weird. Um, sorry. I don't think the chain backwards does anything, does it? One, two, three, four, yeah. five. Yeah. Does it give him a GFI? Yeah, yeah. Uh, but now Sol can blitz the fleshy if he wants. Or he could come in for a... Uh, I'd go for the 5 plus, strip. yeah. Either way. I mean, it's guaranteed to work this time, right, isn't it? Because it didn't work last time, so... Yeah. That's how uh, maths works, right? Yep. Yeah, he only did one, he only did one GFI, yeah. But leaving the goal on the rogue was better. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, yeah, he was he was here, wasn't he? So it was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then he rolled a one, didn't re roll it. I don't think you can screen this, so I don't know. No, it might you might be doing like the screen and then try the the rogue blitz. Uh I don't know this. Neither do I really. 
Who just gets to surf? I gotta run out and score. Yeah, that's the problem, isn't it? Maybe he should have gone for the 5 plus in strip again. Yeah, I would have gone for the 5 plus. Oh, here we go, he's got the scoring threat. Oh, so he should try and move the right ogre before he does. Oh, he's just bits him in the right ogre. Yeah, I don't like this. He's just going to surf the gut. Well, right he's going to put this lineman on the on the wolf, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. He shouldn't have done that already. Yeah. Well, it doesn't matter. He hasn't rolled any dice yet. Okay, he's not, oh. he's not doing that. No. Errata, oh, errata. He, he has to get guarantee the 2D into 2D. Yes. And he gets the knockdown here, oh. so now he gets to put this blitzer on there. Oh, that's a really nice one, D. And now, there you go. No, he's not guaranteeing the Aroga move. I think oh, wait, what, is what is happening? What is happening? Sacrifice. Oh, well, oh, he's, he's rolled a one. <laughs> Most reliable big guy in the game. Oh, he's definitely blitzing, though. Yep. I know. That's why I said but it, because it actually, actually has, he has facilitated it with that position, hasn't he? Gets the pow. Oh. So, it means he has to blitz. Well, it's either the 4 plus dodge, which is 75%. I'd still surf it and dodge. Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah, it's instant. Instant. Three dice surf. And uh, so basically guaranteed surf. And then 75% score. Oh, maybe not, right? Maybe you could blitz the wolf and then, what, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, GFI, GFI. So you could actually maybe blitz the Rolga and then go 3, 2, 2. So that's slightly more like You're slightly more likely to get the surf, uh, the score, if you don't go for the surf. But yeah, you'll obviously surf. Uh, there was any doubt about that. Oh, yeah, hand off to the wolf and then surf and score as well. Yeah, yeah. Oh god. Oh beautiful yeah, that's play. pretty nice actually, that's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Get the surf. This isn't a GFI, is it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, yeah. But really, really sold really should have put a player on that wolf. Oof. And Andy gets the score. Mmm. Nice time. Yep, you know, that was good, the, the handoff. Very good. Yeah, if only Sol put that line right on the wall, it would have been more interesting. Yeah, yeah, he had to put something on there. He, just he could have to. still done that, he could have still done that, and then just left the back, back bottom untags, and then... Yeah, and it would have been a 2 into a 1, but I think that was worth... It was, it was like, the, that was so obvious, right, the the, the wolf being there, right? Eh? Yeah, that's what exactly what I was doing, yeah. I, I would have been a moron and just done the dodge instead of the handoff. But yeah, I would have done as well, yeah. 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 I'm not feeling good today. I played <laughs> terribly already, as, as Dimmy can testify. <laughs> yep. Yep. And I'm going to have to play Chunter straight after, oh dear. And it's oh, like I would, I would wake you up like a pack of smelling Yeah. No, yeah. This but... isn't a very good setup against the Rogar. No. This is very easy. Yeah, this is better. This is better, this is better. Yeah, yeah, it's not, you need the side step. Now he's got to punch the side step and then blitz the... Yeah. The, yeah, yeah, he's just got to punch. Oh, it's really hard to punch. Oh, God. Yeah, it's rough. Oh. <clears throat> yeah, you can't really hit the wolf either. No, it's pretty rough. So it's going to be... A 1D on the side stepper, and he has the power. And then even then, how do you still get the blitz in afterwards? Yeah, this is... This is pretty fucked. Oh, yeah, he doesn't follow and then the Rattoga comes in the side, mate. Right? How, does, <coughs> how yes. does the Rattoga come in? If he powers... Then where do you hit, where do you, where, where's your player hitting the Wraith? The Golem, you, you, the Rattoga's hitting the Golem. Where's the player hitting the Wraith? Here? Oh, right in front of him, directly in front directly of him. In front of him. And where's the yeah. roger? One square back. One square back. 
Yeah, yeah. Like he doesn't need to be on the LOS. <clears throat> I think he does to... because otherwise he could size up to there and block his path, right? So you have to have the roger there. Well, no, no. You have someone else there as an assist. So you have like a line right there. Why not just oh, have the roger there? Five seconds left for uh, Sol, and it still has a minute and a half. But yeah, you have to hit from there. Yeah, you have to hit from there. You have to hit from there with the roger here, and then he size up to there or there. And then you've got or, <coughs> or you go ultra rowdy and just do the dodge with the roger behind the wolf and then shuffle yeah. the wolf. So you yeah, honestly, the... just go for the six plus dodge. And then, yeah, yeah I think that's what he's doing. <laughs> I think Although, if he's, he's doing, doing that, then he he needs to move that line right because that's where the wolf's going. Oh god, it's it's sh even that shit as well. Because look, he's strength four, five, six, seven. So that's terrible. So I think he has to put the the rat ogre here. One D pow, and then dodge the gutter in here, and then blitz him. Yeah, it's, this is really hard. Yeah, it's cooked. This is why you need to remove a wraith. Yeah, I don't know what this is. This seems. Uh... Oh, he's just gonna surf a zombie, I think. Oh, quick snap! He could have also thought, but he should have also factored in the quick snap, shouldn't he? Yeah, oh, quick snap makes it incredibly snap would have made everything. And he hasn't. He hasn't factored it in. He hasn't. Oh, this gutter here should have been for a quick snap, either here or here for a quick snap, and then he could have blitzed the wolf. And, uh, yeah, 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 he could have blitzed the wolf from yeah, the side. Yeah. Hang on, what square is that wolf in? Yeah, yeah, he could, I don't know what square he's in. <laughs> yeah. He's there, okay. So yeah, you dodge the gutter in and then chain the wolf through the side stepper. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe yeah, not. Yeah, he should have definitely had someone for side step. Alright, here we go. <laughs> so I think this yeah, gutter is going to cancel both of these assists. Oh yeah, the... no. Yeah, I think the gutter was going to cancel both assists and then the rogue was going to dodge in to blitz 1D. It was rough, wasn't it? It was. It was really rough. This was a good, good anti... anti-rogue setup. Oh, alright, alright. Why the fuck did he do the six plus dodge instead of dodging, <laughs> doing the four, like the four plus dodge? Yeah, yeah, I don't what know. The, I wasn't gonna get in comms until then. I was <laughs> like, oh, did they, is this just two children playing? <laughs> did did, did <laughs> Dave and Saul leave and just ha and just get some kids to start playing? What, what am I watching in this game? Let's, let's remember, we don't know if the real Saul because you know it's DE. <laughs> Seven nine three four nine C O E. Oh gee, that's right. Could be anyone. It could be anyone. Yeah. Holy shit! I think that was the worst play I've watched all game, and that's that's saying something because I've seen some garbage. <laughs> oh my god, more than coming with the punishment. Yeah, I don't, I don't play it. I don't play in Super are League. You, I talk all the shit. Are applying? Are you applying to play the Blue Bowl Super League? I could. This, if goblins drop, yeah, sure. I oh. could do better than this. I couldn't do worse. There you go. The challenge has been Jesus. Used. This is a challenge. Uh... Jesus Christ. Oh, oh my, my god. god. Moradam. Fucking all oh. guns blazing. Look at it. Spicier Luka than the salsa I've got. Luka <laughs> straight from Detroit. You know, yeah. Moradam asking for me the number one player in the North America. Yeah. <laughs> That's not a high bar either, though. That's a pretty low bar. So, Sol is actually ranked number one in the it's, it's a pretty low bar, but you don't have it. Sol has it. <laughs> oh, my God. He only has it because no one else worth a shit plays. <laughs> North America. <laughs> oh, well, it's still, it's still a charm. Oh, my God. Oh, let's see the best. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I have a, 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 I watched a video yesterday. So the, the trailer of a fake documentary, but he has a part that <laughs> should be should be the intro for the Blood Bowl 3 World Cup. I'm gonna paste it on the in the mm. chat now. Oh, Stiletto on a good runner. 
that's pretty great, isn't it? I bet you wish you'd have that on defense. <laughs> What is the play for Sol? It looks like he's going to attack it, doesn't it? Or something. But then he's got a roger there, so... Who knows? Chalice nerves. Oh, oh wow. Sports mockumentary. That looks amazing. I'll watch that later. I can't have it now, of Yeah, course. but, but, but the, the part of Jeff Goldblum is like he's talking about Blood Bowl. It's <laughs> 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 so dollars in the line. A sport with dozens of fans. <laughs> they have never been more medium. Football <laughs> three World Cup. Amazing. <laughs> A game with literally dozens of little <laughs> of different players. That was incredible. That was incredible. The first night of Five Major FW commentary yeah, was just yeah, instant yeah, my, hit. My, my call to glory, you know, instant, <laughs> God, instant glory, instant eternity, instant. Beginning of an era. Hey! <laughs> wow. Oh my god, this is perfect. Well, wow. seeing as more dancing, I'm going to take this opportunity to go and make my dinner, so I shall, I shall be right back. Yeah, okay. Are you having salsa, or are you, Jimmy? Oh, no, probably he's uh, going to eat chicken and, rice. chicken and rice. I am I'm having salsa. For dinner? I had it for breakfast. Oh my god. <laughs> Adults can have whatever they want, whenever they want, uh, Jimmy. Yeah. 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 You, you still the picture? I have 58 quarts. I gotta start getting through that shit. I think I go through a quart a week and I'll still have six quarts left for next year. I did have a look at the picture. It looks incredible. It's a lot. Yeah. It's, uh. It's, I blame my mom. She was like, hey, you wanna come over and make some salsa? I was like, yeah, sure. She's like, I bought three fucking batches of what the hell they are measured tomatoes in. Bo uh. What did it start to be? Bundles? Batches? Batches. Batches? It was a shit ton is what it was. Now, Three times back the to the game, life. there is something interesting happening besides the one Oh, that he's got reroll that. Oh! Only has 40 seconds left in the time bank. Yeah, he's got no real scoring for it. I guess. Oh no, there's a guy running there. He did disregard. If you'd have snaked that pickup, that would have been pretty interesting. Yeah, he's just going for, he's got to go for the win, isn't he? He's just going to try. Does, and... yeah. It's a lot easier just scoring than it is stalling with rats as well. Yep. Yeah, they don't play defense nearly as well as they play, or offense rather, as well as they play defense. So he's going to, yeah, he's going to hit the Rogar. And then stick a flesh golem in there and the other wraith in there, I guess. Make the hand off for what it'll be. Oh, he can't feel that square, so if he's punching the rogar, he's only going to get one guy in there, which means it's a 3 plus hand off, 4 plus with the other zombie. Mm. <clears throat> Jamming a lot of dudes in for that. Yeah. If he doesn't knock the Rogue over, if he just gets the push, it's uh, awkward as well. Yeah. Maybe he's gonna blitz. Oh no, he's already blitzed. Yeah, so disregard. Yep. Yeah. I thought he might um, blitz the gutter runner with the zombie on the floor, but no. So what's he got here? Yeah. I guess he's got a free plus out and then. Hmm. Or he blitzes the golem with the rat ogre, which will give him a two dice block on the zombie, which then means he can just hand off on a two plus and then. Because <coughs> you, you push the zombie up and. Right, uh, like up into the sideline, so then you've got like the weak diagonal handoff. Yeah. The only problem is, is the rat ogre is. Oh no, it's two into two. Fine. I'm trying to see if there's a way you can knock down that that wolf just below, just hand off to the rackle one, just hide, you know, yeah, just, just run up, score the next turn, right instead. Of just switch sides, yeah. Yeah, because I mean you're just gone if you can get that one. 
that one wolf down. Or just, you know. Oh. Oh, he's got Hello, wrestling. You say he's got wrestling. wrestling. Yeah, it's just... yeah. It's not really. It's not ideal. No. No, no, no. no. He's, he's not the. The best result. He's not going to be able to outrun this wolf either. He's so... not going to be able to get in range easily either. Yeah. Oh, Elliot, uh, Elliot is yeah, in the room. Good. In the chat room. Oh, wow. It came up with auto mod. That's pretty. Elliot banned yeah. Biffcock. I, I, I denied the message and Elliot uh, banned him. Good work, lads. Double, double tag. <clears throat> yeah, I think he could have gone for the score there, to be honest. He was literally like blitz with the golem, uh, blitz the roger onto the golem, and then he had a two die on the zombie. He only needed a push, and then you just hand off on a two plus, and you score. Mm. And that. He, did he re-roll that? Yeah, he re-rolled that and yeah. failed. And now I, I think, think the wolf he had to because I think the wolf could yeah just come around, yeah. right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. I mean, it's a dodge, I think, rather than a GFI. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I mean, you can either double GFI and not have a follow up, or you can just dodge and then have four dice. I guess the, the thing is with this, though, is even if he does back him, he's not really going anywhere. He's not going to be able to pick it up with anyone. Yeah, true. There's plenty of other guys. So around. there's probably no point in even going for the sack here, I don't think. Oh. Just hit the gut runner at the front. Yep. Do your punches. He's got a, what, three dice with the. The golem. The golem, yeah. He's got a so. surf and a ball sack. Oh no, he stood that guy up. Okay. Yeah, I didn't realize this guy got stood up. Um, oh! oh. Reroll burn. Mm, and no surf. Yeah. Four. He could still have a ball sack here. That's a lot of dice, though, isn't it? Good. It's just, yeah, I don't it's... think it's worth it. I mean, he's going to I don't think it's anyway. worth it either. No, I don't think he'll just jam in. Yep. Blitz like this, blitz this line rat and jam in. I'll be even blitz the gutter and not jam in. <laughs> yeah, I would have blitzed the gutter. Mm -hmm. I think. Yeah. I'm just going to blitz the other wolf, I guess. Should tag that other guy with the wraith. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He's got double GFI, that bloody uh, lino, uh, lino gutter runner. Got double G of fire, so it's not even that good. He might, yeah, he's just gonna. I think he's gonna blitz this with the wolf, and then he's gonna tag the gutter run out with a goal on the quatrix. And uh, yeah, yeah, I don't hate it. Forces him to roll more dice to score. Well, yeah, he can't go, he can't afford to go backwards. That's the thing, nope. so he has yeah. to go forwards if he's gonna score. Yeah, unless he's gonna hand off to that other one that's tagged by a wolf, then you have to free him up. Yeah, free two, I guess. Yeah. He's got nobody available. Yeah, I guess that's. Uh... I don't want to hit yeah. him the ball here. He might. No, he's not. Oh. He's just hitting the liner. Oh, this means he can double tag him, I guess. He can double tag that gutter runner, tag the ball, and then double tag the leading gutter runner. Oh no, just double tag the ball. Uh, this is just 2 plus, 2 plus, 3 plus, 2 plus, right? I, I think yeah. he probably should have double tagged the leading gutter runner. Yeah, I kind of agree. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I did, he doesn't even need to do the double dodge, he just does the one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, 3 plus. So 2 plus, 3 plus, 2 plus. Oh, he's... Or... Or... Just oh, that's something completely different. Yeah... I guess he doesn't have to score this turn, but he's... I don't know, like, I thought he'd go for a win. Speed. Yeah, well, but I just don't know... How do you keep it I safe? I mean, if you're like, going you for the quickest that. score, you're going for the quickest score. Well, this is not a quickest score. I'm disappointed. Uh, yeah. I think he's just playing for a draw. I guess... Or you just... Dodge out the gutters and make a... Game? 
Yeah, he has to bring the other one back from up front, which means he won't be able to score. Blitz with the Rat Ogre. Blitz the either probably the Golem to be honest. In the Golem yeah. on the side. Yeah. Well, that's two into one unless he stands up that other guy. So maybe he blitzes the size up there. Yeah. I'm not sure I like that before doing the dodge on the leading one to get the ball safe. Yeah! I'm like not sure. <laughs> I mean, it's the one in 36, which is the one in 36 for the dodge as well. But, yeah. I mean, it yeah, is. is good. But he could have also just rolled, like, even if he rolled a one and knocked the other guy down, like, it frees up. I got him. I got him. <laughs> just. Going and hit Four, the ball. Five, six, up. seven, eight, nine. He needs to do a GFI with a stripper as well, I think. Uh -huh. Maybe not. Maybe you could just sit behind him. Yeah, he did. There you go. And that's more yeah. or less a gate. Yeah. Yeah, this is fine. Means he's not scoring next to. Oh, he's cold. With the blitz. He's not scoring this turn, he's not scoring next turn. Yep. I thought it must be. No, I am going to be mean because I don't give a shit. I don't think he's scoring at all. <laughs> I don't think Soul knows how to right click the end zone at this point. Big it depends board, what he wants, board. doesn't it? It depends what he wants. Like, I don't know. Yeah. I just, it just seemed like he was setting up to, to score early, right? Like, he's clearly not setting up for that now. Maybe he does. To, maybe he just wants to stall for the draw. Because like, if he wanted to maybe. score, he would have scored last time. Yeah. Well, because like, what's his? Does he need to score, or does he need to to win this game? Well, it doesn't matter. This game, like, whether Sol wins or draws or loses, like, he can't do anything. So, but well, so I then guess... you might as well go for the win just to piss Andy off. Yeah, yeah. I think right? I don't know. Like, it's hard to say. Like, maybe he just doesn't want to lose, which is fair. Yeah. I mean, I don't get it. I guess I do get it. I get it. I get the draws. You know, it's, a bit, it's a bit of a weird one, really. I I always go for the win. Even when I play fucking shit goblins, I'd still go for the win instead of the draw. <laughs> it's probably better to try and win now. Like, if he still had a chance with a draw, then obviously you just go for the draw. But like now, it doesn't matter. It probably makes more sense to go for the win. But yeah. But again, it's kind of hard to say either way, really. Rats are just all spread out everywhere. They're all on the ground. Yeah, so he's gonna end up potatoing and then maybe getting sacked and then losing. Yep. Yep. He has got like he's got three two pluses to get all the gut runners out at the moment. Yeah. It's, that's on this. Yeah, it's at the time being there. Okay, now we're in the uh, <clears throat> Under pressure. Ooh, I don't. I don't know if I like bringing the other wolf in as much. Uh. I think I would have rather kept him slightly back in case he potatoes. <clears throat> I mean. Mm. He's just gonna blitz with the rat ogre and then throw it to the tackle guy or hand off to the tackle oh, guy or something like that. He's knows. just gonna leap over the downed Skaven and then run. Run up that sideline, you reckon? Yeah. Yep. Oh, no, he's not. Yeah, this one looks like three of the gut runners. What would that leap have been? Is that just a. Three it would have been a three. Yeah, three plus you just gone. You've already got one free guy on the ground over there to kind of block off the the wolves. I think I think it's safe to say at this point he's playing for the draw. Like I think he's practicing just playing for the draw. Yeah. Otherwise, nothing makes sense. So he's probably just thinking <clears throat> practice against a good coach, getting a draw from like for next season. It makes more sense that you play for the draw in this sort of matchup. 
like when it matters. Just for the experience, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I yeah because, I don't know because what it's mean. math. So. Maybe, maybe, maybe practice to get the win should be more useful in the long term. Uh, yeah. It's hard to say. I mean, if this was game one, right, of next season, you play for the draw at this point, right? Yeah. But then yeah, it could right. also be it could also be like game three, where you have to win, and in which case, no. I would play for the win here because the practice playing for the win I think is more important. Like the playing for the draw is easier than playing for the win. I don't know, man. I think. <laughs> I think playing for the win is probably easier than playing for the draw, to be honest. But I he's just bang it in he, right here. He's doing a mental gymnastics space cadet level. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. He's trying to confuse his opponent so that even his opponent is like, what the fuck is he doing? I mean, that's the other thing as well. Is like Andy kind of has the confusion of not knowing what he wants to do. Like, like normally you'll know, oh, right, they're playing for a win. So like it can, you can kind of adjust accordingly, but like at the moment, I don't have any idea what Souls doing, whether he's winning or losing or what. Well, he failed a roll there. That's not how you win. No. Well, Saul's still alive, isn't he? He's got all his gutters. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. But uh, we're wondering uh, if he, Dimi was giving us an explanation why he maybe is practicing to play for draws. <laughs> all right, what's that? Oh, because team, well, like, it's a team thing. <laughs> yeah, well, he might just... Oh, well, I guess he's playing in Europe, I wouldn't he, with rats, right? So maybe he wants to just practice getting a draw for the team, you yeah. It looked like he was going to go for the win, and then all of a sudden it looked like no, he's not interested in the win at all. He's just going to play for the draw. So, mm. it's... I mean, at yeah, the end of the day, yeah, win or it. win or loss doesn't matter, right? What matters is what he needs. If he needs more practice at defense or offense, and like he maybe probably it's needs, both. yeah, <laughs> I think playing against a really good coach, trying to get a draw, I think is probably better practice for Euro Bowl than just banging it in and going for a win. Yeah. It's not as interesting to watch, is it? It's not. Well, it is. I, I don't know. I think I think, I think. think the eight-turn drive with rats is way harder than the two or three-turn. Or four-turn, or whatever you call it. I think the actual yeah. eight-turn is way harder. Yeah, anyone can bang it in quick. This is a brilliant, yeah. brilliant turn for Sol here, isn't it? Brilliant yeah, opportunity. Yeah. You can blitz the wolf and get everything off. Okay. Oh, that's or he can blitz right, a zombie. Okay. And this is okay because he gets this punch as well, so he gets to move like the whole team up here. But I, I think I would have gone up this time. But I guess this this skin stalls it. They can really stall for a long time, can't they, Skaven? Because it's so easy to just go nine squares on the last turn. So maybe this is better yeah. to uh, just get more punches. Max blocks. Bang bang. Yeah, how many Doritos do you have, uh, more of them? Yeah, I saw Ali's question. I wasn't even gonna humor it. Doritos with salsa, like. What do you have? What do you have with salsa? Like tortilla chips, chips like tortilla like, chips. They are Doritos, yeah. right? Oh God. I mean, technically, yes. technically, a Dorito is a tortilla chip, but that's kind of like saying that, you know, a chicken nugget is chicken. Like, yeah, you're technically don't, don't true, go but there because you, you are using Spanish words that doesn't mean what they they have been used for. Yeah, tortilla yeah, is good. not that cheap thing. I don't know where that yeah. uh, came from. Tortilla is omelet in Spanish, and yeah. salsa is just the word sauce in awesome. Spanish. Oh yeah, yeah. So I why why have right. they named why have they named the dance after sauce? The what? Because it's saucy, isn't it? Oh, it's a bit fucking saucy. Isn't salsa... Oh, right, so it's just a saucy dance. Is that what it means? Like, yes, is that... exactly, exactly. Yeah. Yes, salsa. Oh. Yeah, but when people say, yeah, I'm going to add salsa to the food, which one? Salsa, which one? So what does salsa no? mean? For so example, it... for example, salsa bolognese. See, see? See, that's what we say, bolognese, full name oh, yeah, of bolognese cause... in Spanish. Yeah, salsa bolognese. bolognese. 
Yeah, because tortilla chips are what to topo? It's something like that, right? What is the what is a chip in? I thought that in Spanish. Potato. Uh, yeah. A potato yeah. Cr crisp, right? Okay. A chip, yeah. A chip, yeah. It's just not made of potato because the ones I have are made of uh, corn. Corn flour, yeah. I can't eat them anymore because of the uh, gluten in it. Yeah, they're like genetically modified to God knows. <laughs> yeah. Just the yeah. way that they should be. Well, they're all like covered in pesticides as well, aren't they? Processed in it, processed oh, to death. Processed yeah. foods are bad. Yeah. Super ultra processed, I think. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's trans well, I mean, to fats, be, isn't it? To, to be fair, I, I make my own chips, so I. Yeah. Oh, yeah they're not processed. Yeah. 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 Go through all that work to make salsa, and I can take the five minutes to make the chips. Are the easy part. That's that's easy. Mm. Salsa is way more work. I didn't Wait, mean like so genetically now, now modified. Gene I meant like they're covered in uh, covered in uh, pesticides. Oh, there's a cast. Oh. There's a cast. Oh, look at those! Look, he's got his little warp stones. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, no, that's nice. <laughs> that's, oh. for, that's for the rave after the match, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's all glow sticks. <laughs> <laughs> I hated this move, by the way, because now all of this shit is right in front of him. Whereas if he'd gone up here, okay, he might have only got the start of another turn, but it's better than just having the, his whole fucking. Team he didn't get to bang fucking... though, Jim, did he? He didn't get the two blocks. True. Well, it was only one, but yeah, was... I really like it because he got the bang of wolf, which is really good, isn't it? So I, yeah, that I, is I really like going up that way. Mm. Rather than just saying, "Oh, please stick your, stick your wraith and fleshy in my face," I wasn't a fan of. But he wasn't in a rush to get forward. He's still got plenty of time, hasn't he? And I yeah. Tend to oh, panic a little bit. Going back to the important matter: Are you gluten intolerant now, Jimmy? Am I, I pardon? Think, uh, are you gluten intolerant now? No, um, I don't know. So this is the thing, right? Um, you can get a test to see if you're like allergic to gluten or something, but the uh -huh. gluten intolerance is very hard to find in blood tests. So then I oh, thought, it? yeah, and I thought, well, I, I'm just gonna just make the choice to go gluten free, and then hopefully it'll it'll do some good. <laughs> Basically. Do you reckon you just do the two out the back here, right? So the two, one, two, three, four, yeah. five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then you, yeah, and you, you go in the same level with the Ratoga. Uh, maybe slightly lower than the Ratoga, actually. What's next to the Ratoga? Is there a guy next to the Ratoga? No, there isn't, okay. Yeah, so the, the Ratoga can block, then this guy can two plus out, this guy can two plus out, this guy can one D blitz him. And come up, and then he yeah. can too. So hey, I hate this. Oh, yeah. Red, red base. Why is he? Why hate is he, this by soul. Why has he done that? I don't know. Why has he done anything, Denny? Why has he done anything? This game? <laughs> to, <laughs> to free up this blitz, maybe to make this blitz a two D. But I would have just oh, dodged okay. these two as on two pluses first. But now he's got to put Plus someone next to the roger to make the block, and if the roger bites him, then it's very can chain with all good. Like he can. He can cage with the ogre though, can't he? So it's not so bad. With the roger? Yeah, he can cage with Yeah, but what I'm saying is if the roger bites the guy, he knocks the guy over. Yeah, so but then he can cage with... Like, he can use the roger as the cage then, can't he? Yeah. So there's, no, I mean. there's no blitz, so if you're one in nines, he's... Yeah, fucked. exactly. Yeah, it's pretty fucked, isn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And he has to activate him because he's got no tackle zone. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hmm. It's spicy. Okay. Well, yeah, so he's kind well, of screened, screen, isn't he? Yeah. Well, yeah, but still, if he if he bites his own player, he's screwed it. Yeah, true. Yeah, he's completely fucked if he bites his own player. Yeah. And then if he one in nines, he's, well, he's, he's got well. a three plus, hasn't he? He's got a three plus to fix it. One two. Three, oh no, the one in four, nine's fine. Six, the one in nine's fine. Yeah, yeah, the one in nine is fine. The, the danger is because you got player. the screen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. The screen's okay. good. And if he bites his own player, he just has to dodge this. Oh, there, oh, there is the one in nine. There's the one in nine. Might not be fine, actually. <laughs> He's re rolled it. Is there yeah. Roland? Uh, KO's himself. And, this fucking and, yeah. rogue. Might not be fine because there's a fucking 
the, the on Rogers first beast. removal of the you can, you can, Well, yeah, you can double GFI blitz it with that if you want. No, no, the, the, the werewolf just goes one, two, one, three, two four. three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, yeah easy. You can, you can chain. You can even chain this one forward, right? Yeah. I mean, can he make it three dice with the werewolf? One, two, three. Like, so if he GFIs the zombie, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it's either a double GFI, I don't think it's worth that. No, no I think it's just, just go for the four. I mean, you're getting 40 anyway, yeah. aren't you? That's pretty good. Yeah. I think you chain him forward with the... With the he can move the flesh golem in and then chain yep. the wolf. Yep. Or chain... He can chain the... He could chain it. He could chain the wraith to make it three, but then he needs the pow. Yeah. Yeah, I don't hate chaining the wraith to make it a three dice. But it's, it's it's three into three, yeah 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 yeah. And then yeah, he yeah. doesn't activate the, he doesn't activate the ghoul either, so the ghoul could do some recovery nonsense. No, I think it's best to just just chain the wolf and get the two D. Yeah, the advantage of chaining. Oh, well, you would chain the wolf. Yeah, I was going to say because you could you could just not chain it all and then you might like, even chain him twice, right? At the moment, you chain him once and he goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But if you chain him twice, he's even got an extra squares left to, you know, recovery on OG if I when he gets a push. He's not chaining. Okay. Well. And he's GFIing. Okay. Alright. So this is a two into three, so this is like the best way of doing it, I guess. Uh, this is like uh, a two into yeah, three. Yeah. Ah, he's a clever dick, isn't he, that David? Yeah, it makes it, sense. It's not that good. It saves you a GFI, but then. Yeah, but this way he's he not doing the chain. Attack. Oh, I hate that. No, hate no, no, no. He's, he's knocking him back, which means he gets the. Hate the... that. I fucking hate that. It saves him doing the blockless block, but it's definitely worse. Well, no, he's going with the ghoul, so he's doing a three into three with the ghoul. Or no, he's doing it with the wolf. It's just he's just done it wrong. He's in my... just... Oh, he's just leaving. Uh, he's leaving the ghoul. Very, the wrong. Very, very wrong. Oh, he's got to re-roll that. Yeah. Very wrong. Bad yeah. day of all. Into three. Reroll that. No. He's got to reroll that one if he rerolled <laughs> the first one. Come on, put it in. Come on. Come well, on. Only, at, this, at this stage, at this stage, I think you have to reroll it because yeah, you're I playing for the win, and I don't think Soul's going to score. Because Soul scores oh, next yeah, turn, yeah. so he's only got one I mean, turn. So it, this is a 3 2 for Soul to score, and then if he scores, you've, you've only got one reroll, and you've got no rerolls in two turns. Yeah. But he's not going to turn you over, so yeah, you might as well reroll it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, right. yeah, because yeah, you, you're basically saying the reroll is saying I accept the draw. Yeah. If it was well, the no, turn but, before, I mean, if it was the turn before, you could not reroll it, because then you've got a reroll for three turns. But now that Soul's only got one turn, he can't score on your offense. So you yeah, know, you yeah, have yeah. To this is what I'm saying. That without a blitz or a, t you have kick to reroll uh, this. He did not. Doesn't doesn't reroll it. Okay. I think mean, you have to reroll that. So now you've got to tag the other gutter, and it's a uh, four, two. Or I guess he's got to tag the other gutter, and he's just got to go north of the gutter. Yeah. So one, two, three. Oh, five, six, seven, eight, nine, two, five, two, four. Yeah, so he has to do the 4-2. Four, 4-2 four, is pretty... You can, uh, you can uphill the fleshy first, right? You can... Uh, you wouldn't uphill the fleshy though, would you? Probably. You just you'd blitz uphill well, you with can the one fleshy. Well, you can 1-D the fleshy first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, well, he, he's lost a skill to do the stack. Oh, the, so, the, the yeah, he's only got there. the tackle blitzer and a skill splitter, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, so it's a 2 plus, right? It's a 2 plus to make it a 3 plus. Two yeah, plus. With, a, with a re roll, yeah, yeah. You have to dodge yeah. this guy off. And then you can dodge this guy off, but I don't think he really does anything. Uh, yes, yeah, so the 1D in the fleshy is a 4 plus, but it's only a turnover on a 1, isn't it? That's the thing. So it's like you're free rolling, aren't you? You're free rolling by trying this. Oh, nice. So he didn't get the four plus, but if he'd no, got the if he'd got the four plus, then it would have this would have been like a maybe he's even a two plus here. What is it? One, well, maybe two, three, like four, is five, is six, the seven, eight, nine. yeah? This would just been a two plus if he if he'd got the paddle. So that was so that was the, well. It, that was definitely isn't there. isn't the uphill 
Oh no, it's not an uphill blitz, is it? Because it's three dice. Yeah, honestly, he probably probably hey. should have moved this guy Hodged around. I just got around and did the four plus. He probably should have moved this guy around. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No. It's really. What about going through this way? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Maybe you should have done that, right? Two plus three plus two plus, and then he could have got there. And then this would have been a two D, and then he would have made it a three two. But he obviously couldn't gone backwards there. I don't know. It was definitely right to hit the fleshy in some capacity because if you knock over the yeah. fleshy, it's pretty good. It's way easier. Yeah. Yeah. So now you just blitz the guy with the wolf, and then. Tuck him behind, surf the stripper, and then you bring the wraith back on the ball, and then. Oh, now you, you... click at random. Now you just click at random. It's <laughs> it's done, isn't it? <laughs> well, I surf. I definitely surf the stripper, and then I probably foul the other one. To be honest with you. Yeah. Yeah. Um. So I think this was the play actually. Right, three, two this way. One, two, three, four, five, six, oh, seven, eight, 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 nine, That's and then GFI. Stop. And then you've got 2D there, and you re-roll for the POW. And then you just 2 plus, 2 plus to score. That, that was the way, I think. I mean... I don't know about wow, that. Wow, there? Actually, yeah, that's... Uh. Well, he's, he's glad he kept that re-roll from last turn. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, you could try now the you, block and then the blitz would be Now you block, yeah. you block with the block, right? And then you uh, bow and then you go for the pickup. No? I don't think you go for the pickup. Uh, well, maybe. Okay, got the, you yeah, just, just foul, now you do. Just yeah, foul. I bow, I bow, and then, it, yeah, and then do, I yeah. go for the pickup, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, he's not going for the pickup at all, so you just put six with the thing. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you don't. I guess you don't need to pick up so that guy gets stunned. Yeah, I guess breaking armor's breaking armor's more important than picking the ball up, right? Yeah, yeah. And it's good. The other gut has gone now as well. Could have even blocked with that, with that, with that zombie. Oh no, he hasn't got a real. Okay, errata, errata. Shouldn't have made that block. He should have just done the foul before that block. That was that was absolutely incorrect to make that block first, wasn't it? This guy's completely irrelevant. He should have done the foul first. But, uh, yeah, this is the win then, isn't it? This yep. is the win. Yep. Yep. Skip the turn. Skip turn. Oh, he I did skip he it. He skipped it. He skipped it. Yeah. 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 Well played. Yeah, there you go. So Andy is... He might have been the first person to go in five, Super zero, League zero. to go five zero zero. yeah. I'll just check. Bear with me. Um, We're bearing, Jim. There you go. go. I'm clean it. Uh, a clean sweep like Spain in the Euro Cup. Oh, Do yeah. You might remember it happened, it, yeah. it happened this summer, you know, it was a file and everything. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Lucky weren't there, the Spanish. I don't remember it. <laughs> oh, no, Christopher went 5 0 in season 2. Uh, Did he? Yeah. With what? Um, I can't remember. Humans? I don't fucking know, do I? It was ages Humans? ago. Humans? I don't know. Or was it in Blood Bowl 2? It was Blood Bowl 2, yeah, so maybe. It might have been Chaufs. No, I think it would be humans. Or... I think it would have been humans, yeah. But, um... Five zero zero with humans is insane. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Um... Bloody Nora. Bloody Nora. Flipping Nora. Um, so there you go. Anyway, I haven't updated the tables yet, but yes, that will put Andy on ten points. Perfect score. Sol remains on three, which means I finish third, which is nice. Uh, regardless of my result versus Chunter, I will finish third, but tragically um, will not make the playoffs for the first time. But there you go. Um, great result for Andy season overall. Congratulations to him. Commiserations to Sol. Thank you very much to all of the commentators. Absolutely glorious, guys. Uh, pleasure to yeah. be here. Thank you. Le learn a lot about the Dimi and Uranus. <laughs> Pronounced Uranus. <laughs> 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 Thanks for watching everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.